Okay. Well, hello, everyone in uh, YouTube comic book land here. Uh, my name's Todd. Um, I've commented on a few of your videos. Um, my uh, screen name is Gimpy204. I'm actually not a Gimpy if that offends anybody. Gimpy's my cat. So I've had people comment negatively to me. And they always use the, oh, uh, Gimpy. You guys are Gimpy. No, I'm not a Gimpy. He's a Gimpy. Hi, Gimpy. So, anyways, I, uh, I watch, uh, a lot of comic book videos on here, and uh, when I decided to do this, it's it's what can I show that hasn't been shown? Everybody's, you know, you've got Captain Strange Live, Quest and Brom Star, uh, Howler Mouse. Uh, they've all got everything. So there's a video on everything, supposedly. So. The only thing I can think of is I got a box of movie comics, so I thought maybe I'd pull some of those. I don't know necessarily a lot about every one of these comics, but I've got a lot of comics, just nothing real super important, I guess. But, uh, okay. We'll, uh, take off that, and, uh, okay, we'll start the box off with, uh, movie comics. Like I said, we're doing movie comics. So, here's 2001 miniseries. Got the number two on the back here. Preserving back, backers and boards aren't cheap, so. Okay. We won't do this whole box, it's full. I don't use normal comic boxes. I work at Kroger's, so. Uh, I utilize what we actually have there. I use pop tart boxes. What the boxes come in pop tarts, and they hold about uh, hundred. If they're not bagged and boarded, maybe hundred and twenty. So if they're bagged and boarded, maybe hundred, maybe a little bit more if they're tight. So I've got about seventy-three of these. So it comes out to be about seven thousand comics here. And I know there's a lot of the guys on here have way more than that, so. Like I said, most of mine aren't that important. Okay, so what else we got? Alien Nation. <sighs> oh, yeah. Remember, this is a kid. Annie. I don't know if we can even see these. Got a glare going here. Okay. And number two. Some of these I'll skip over. Some of them aren't as important, but A team. Actually these aren't just movie comics, these are movie or TV. So anything that's been, you know. Okay. I love this one. Blade Runner. We gotta speed up something to get this glare off. Okay, Blade Runner. One. And number two on the back side here. I only do that normally if it's an even number of if it goes four issues, then I'll put one and two, three and four together. But if it's like a one, two, three mini series of movies, I'll give them their own bags. Uh, I actually still need one of these. Love this movie. The Black Hole. There we go. If I ramble or don't make sense, then uh, you guys see uh, Captain Strange like sometimes I drink a beer, Howler Mouse drinks beers. <laughs> I don't know if I've seen Quest of Bromstar, but uh, 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 there we go. I drink vodka. Let me take a shot of vodka here. Yeah, this 
movie was gonna, not gonna be in my kitchen. It was gonna be upstairs in my man cave, but uh, my wife stayed up till well, she just went to bed. And it's 3:07 a.m. So it was easier just to do it where the laptop sat. So. <laughs> Cheers. Okay, well. Okay. Here's black hole number two. I don't spend a lot of time on these. Don't, my comics aren't that important. But there's things out there that younger people... I'm 42. There's people out there that are collecting comics and they're 16. They've never seen these. You might have seen the movie. Okay. Dang it. There's a light right up above my head, so the kitchen's not the best place to do this. Black hole number two. Oh, that's black hole number three. I'm sorry, that was three. There's actually a fourth one that takes place. Actually, this one does too. Beyond Black Hole. I think the first two issues, the movie. And then you have Beyond Black Hole. And then there's a fourth issue, and that's as far as I went by Whitman. And I don't have that one. So. Okay, we got. Buckaroo Banzai. One and number two. Buckaroo Banzai. This is a goofy movie as a kid. I loved it. Actually, I don't know if they make it on DVD. I'd love to buy it. Put it in the $5 bin, Walmart. I will own it. Oh, here's a great one. With uh, the Captain America movie that just came out. Actually, why do. They make a movie comic for the new Captain America movie? I haven't paid attention. Anyways, this is the Captain America movie comic that came out for the 1991, 1992, 92 Captain America movie. But I don't know if they have a real copy of that. I actually have a bootleg of it. Shh. Don't tell nobody. Okay, but uh. It's got its good points in the movie. So. Six. Speaking of bad movies. But still, Holly Berry. Mm -mm. Conan the Barbarian. Movie special. Conan the Barbarian. Movie special number two and this right here I don't have okay Conan the Destroyer it is a two issued series I've only got number one so I'm gonna skip through some of these I got almost nine minutes down we barely got there. but I got a show piece anybody that's my age remembers this movie Condor Man and do they make this on DVD? Question Bromstar? Scott, I think's your name. You got this movie? Do they make this on DVD? I want this. Condor Man. How do you. Yeah. Number two. Condor Man. There it is. Number three. Oh, this is gonna be a bad video. I blame vodka. Maybe this vodka's gonna make us bearable. I don't know. Okay, here's a comic that means a little bit to me, and it's a stupid comic. And I don't even remember the movie. And once again, do they make this on DVD? It's older. And the only reason I wanted it, and I actually looked a long time to track this down, but uh, my Best friend growing up had this comic book. There it is, The Deep. And, I, and the reason I wanted this is because my best friend growing up, Curtis was his name, 
we collected comics together, and uh, in our early 20s, he'd killed himself. So most of the comics he was into, I could care less. He was into Master Kung Fu. I was into G.I. Joe. I was into uh, X-Men. He had this comic. Actually, he had the Annie comic, too. It's the reason I bought that. So I wanted this. And I'm actually in the process of trying to get all the Master Kung Fu right now, too. So it just makes me think of him. You know? All, just like movies. Comics take you back to a certain time and place. Let's skip over those. Ah, okay. Dragon Slayer. One and number two. I love this movie. Okay, I've got Dune, but I only have number three. Okay, we can skip it. Here's a TV show. Love this TV show. Don't own any of the box set DVDs. Would love to. There's number one. And it's John Bernard, by the way. And I'm a huge John Byrne fan. It's emergency number two. And I think there might be three or four issues on this. I'm not sure. I know at least three. I know I'm missing at least one. So. <laughs> I gotta get the box sets on the TV series. Gotta quit spending so much money on comic books. That's the problem. Okay. We'll skip over newer. Ah, oh, okay. The Flash TV series. See, some of your younger guys probably don't even remember there was a Flash TV series. I do own the box set of that. That's awesome. Wish they'd do a new movie. So, okay. House 2. It's kind of weird that they even made a comic of that, isn't it? What was House 1? Did they make a comic of House 1? Hmm. It's the second story. Where's the first story? Wow. Another great movie, if you're old like me. The Island of Dr. Moreau. I still love this. And I actually think they continued this after number one, maybe. Does this keep going? If not, it was a concept in the 70s I could have kept going with, you know? They went with Logan's Run, why not? I need to check into that, see if there's more Island of Dr. Moreau. Ah. For your eyes only, James Bond. Okay, anyways, this thing is clicking down. Let's find some more important ones. Crawl. One and number two. Okay. Speaking of Logan's Run, there's number number one of Logan's Run. Number two of Logan's Run. Okay, so Predator, Punisher movie, blah, 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 blah. Raiders of Lost Ark. Those are great comics. The Sonya and Sonya. Rocketeer. It's a pretty good movie, too. Okay, here's one I want to show, though. Most people probably don't remember this, but I loved it as a kid. Rock and Rule. It's a great, great one. Once again, anybody out there know if this is on DVD? So I should be checking this stuff out. Okay. Six Million Dollar Man by Charlton Comics. And I think this is a few issues, but I only care about number one at this point. Maybe at some point if I find them. We go to flea markets every Thursday, and we go to flea market. They have comics five for a dollar. And I actually found this for 20 cents. So, And it's not in the best shape. It's pretty beat up. I don't know if you can even see how beat up it is. We're using my webcam here. I knew it would be trashy, especially with the light above us, so... Oh, well. Spawn. Ah, Supergirl. Okay. Okay, most of these are more modern. There's one. The Swamp Thing Annual on the movie. And I actually don't even know if the movie's in this. Official adaption of Embassy Picture Film, so yeah, it is the. I love those movies. Okay, anyways, this is about to reach my time, and I'll make another video if this one gets any hits, so okay. Talk to you later. Goodbye.